is Shoreham by Sea and the start of my little weekend. We've come from that direction down there, followed the river up from Shoreham by Sea and then come up here. And now I've joined the South Downs Way. That's vaguely the direction I've come from, Shoreham by Sea. And that there is going towards Brighton. This is Full King and Scarpment and it's near Devil's Dyke so you could say it's Fulking Hill although it looks quite nice Taking a little uh, rest here I'm not in any hurry and I need to kill time anyway. Just trying out my new camping stove with the silencer. There's Optimus Polaris Optifuel. Just having hot water with some nice biscuits. And they are actually all nice. direction is the sea. From down there is where I've just come. And then in that direction. It's looking even nicer now. This is the view from a golf club and I'm just sitting at a little table. A bit of water. We've just started the process of cooking, so I'm just heating up some water first and put it to one side. Cook the chorizo, then put some rice and the water back again. And that'll be my uh, dinner. As you can see, I cut the chorizo up in small pieces, kept stirring it while it was on a lower heat and um, cooked it. As you can see, lots of oil comes out. Now I'm going to put in the rice and the and the hot water and make my dinner. And here you see the finished article. You got cooked rice with chorizo, and I put some uh, tandoori spices in there. It's always, putting spices in always adds flavour to the rice. So I let this cool down, and then I'll be. Uh, Dinner time. So this is the tent up for the night. I uh, pitched up reasonably early. Um, it's in a top secret location near some trees and grass. 
Uh, as you can see, it's a Hilleberg Solo. Uh, Rab Neutrino 400 sleeping bag. Uh, Thermarest Xtherm Max Large camping mat. I got the wrong um, inflatable pillow, but never mind. Um, and then I've got Gregory Boltero 75 litre rucksack. So, that'll keep me nice and warm, I think, for the night. Well, this is breakfast time. As you can see, I'm just having hot water with Nutella and Rivita. I know, that is a bit extravagant, having a massive glass jar. But, you know, I think I'm worth it. It's not bad breakfast, I must say. And I slept very well as well. That's the direction I've come from. It's about half nine-ish. So it's quite a late start. But I feel quite relaxed. The weather's looking good. Less cloudy than yesterday. A great view. come from up that direction and it's looking beautiful now I'm heading down there just a quick note to self when you've got your rubbish bag cut off the handles makes putting rubbish away easier just stopped off to pick up a couple of litres of water had a little break here Rivita and Nutella and now I'll carry on with my walk following the river That's uh, Lewis This is South East Church. There's a water point just there. I've just filled up with the water. And I've had a lovely conversation with a couple. And I'm heading off in that direction. And this is South East train station. That's to what to see. That's the direction I've kind of come from, and you can see the locals here, heading up there.
just cooking up some dinner, chorizo and rice. This is me in the tent. I've just pitched it up. I don't know if I can be bothered to do anything else. <sighs> I just want to relax. I've just got my stove on the go. Just going to make some hot water. I've uh, packed up. Going to have breakfast now. Before I do the final section, going up to Eastbourne. And it's looking like a mighty fine day. So I've just come from that direction, which is Alfriston. I'm going through some lovely little villages and stuff. Well, very few, but this one's really nice. This is Kukmir Meanders yeah. and it looks absolutely stunning. I mean, look at that. Have you done that walk out to the Coast Guard cottage? Is that the end? That's the direction I've come from. As you can see, it looks beautiful. Definitely come back here. see it really still and it's warm and sunny it's amazing So I've come from that direction. As you can see, the weather is amazing. Sunny, warm, only a light breeze. This is basically the end. And that there is Eastbourne. 